All right, so some very interesting news has just come out regarding Dragon Ball Z Frieza's Resurrection. Now, apparently, a three-chapter manga adaptation is going to be coming out for this, which, pretty cool stuff. You know, at the end of the day, it makes it feel more canon to the source material with having a manga counterpart. But the interesting thing about this one is it's going to come out, or I believe start coming out, February 21st for the April issue because, you know, it could say April issue, but it comes out like a month or two ahead of time. That's how a lot of these magazines work. And I'm just like, so in a sense, basically the plot of Dragon Ball Z Frieza's Resurrection or the story for that matter is going to come out prior to the actual movie. Like, what? Now, since it's a three chapter adaptation i wouldn't be surprised they're probably going to do like you know one chapter each volume or each issue of the magazine so that way they don't completely go out so we might have like the first chapter might cover who knows how much of content maybe 20 30 minutes worth of content i'm guessing and we'll find out from there but like that's huge because at the end of the day i've never seen something like that where there's going to be a manga counterpart that comes out because the film comes out in april like april 18th i believe something along the lines of that but the actual manga is going to be coming out february 21st so we'll actually have a first glance at what the fuck the movie's going to be about you know damn sure i'm going to be reviewing that to see like overall like because we ain't going to see this movie for a while let's be real here like it comes out in japan in april but we won't see it till who knows when, whenever they decide to bring it over, or if it takes a while for Funimation, because it's understandable, this is new, Toei, etc, etc, but, yeah, I'm actually really interested to see how they're gonna do this, and it's not gonna be drawn by Toriyama either, you know, <laughs> Toriyama, he's like, I'm writing the, the, you know, okay, it's fine, or whatever, here, where's my money at, he don't got time to be doing the manga, so it's gonna be drawn by some group, or some guy, I'm not sure, I've never heard of this, person, or entity, called Toyo Taro, so it's gonna be drawn by somebody else, but, I'm excited to see, like, it's actually, I'm completely surprised that we're actually gonna, a couple months ahead of time, actually know a good chunk of how, at the very least, the movie's gonna start. Now, it's an adaptation, so it could be a little bit different from the actual film, which I kind of hope they do at the same time, so that way we don't get complete blatant spoilers, because, I mean, at the end of the day, let's be real here, it's the internet. If, if I'm not gonna read it myself, somebody's gonna post an image somewhere saying something, or a meme is gonna get started, so it's probably better off that you get it out the way and check it for yourself before it gets, you know, rampant through the internet, but yeah, I don't know, what, what do you guys think about this, the V-Jump issue, again, it's gonna be coming out February 21st, so we'll be roughly around the end of February, knowing more or less the beginning, at the very least, of Dragon Ball Z Freezer's Resurrection, which... I'm, I'm excited, I ain't gonna lie, I'm excited just to see, like, wow, we ain't gotta wait that long at the very least to know a little bit about this film. And yeah, let me know what you guys think, are you excited for this, are you going to check it out, are you gonna wait for the movie? Ideally, I would like to wait for the movie, but it's the internet, it's gonna come by one way or another, and when it gets translated or whatever, I'm gonna just be there like, I can't wait anymore, so I'm definitely gonna check it out and give a little thoughts video or review at the very least of that first chapter, but you know, some people, they, they wanna wait for the film, and that's totally understandable, if you're one of those people, let me know, and why? And your overall thoughts, but that's all I have for this one, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, if you liked anything I had to say, or enjoyed the video, drop me a like, I'd greatly appreciate it, and if you haven't subscribed, if you can do so as well, That'd be awesome. I'm from the world, and as always, people, have an awesome day.